I decided to be where I'm at, at this corner. Take a look at it. I choose this corner because it's close to there over there. Plus, at night it's gonna be cold. So I don't wanna be down there with that sea breeze or lake breeze, whatever you wanna call that breeze, blowing into my tent and my camp, getting me cold. So I choose this top hill. You see it's got a, it's real high from the rest of the area. And I wanna show you my gear that I usually bring out when I go camping with my friend or when I go camping in the middle of the woods. I wanna show you the difference in stuff I use. All right, when I go camping at parks, back up some, you can't see everything. When I go camping to parks and with my friend, I carry these two sticks in my trunk. This is my tea. I want to show you what that tea is. Now, if I'm going in the woods with somebody hiking, I carry these. And these act just as well as these. But these are more sturdy. I can, you know, I can't do this with a stick. I might break it, but these are more sturdy. And it does the same thing by just whoop, and I'll make my tea with these, with these when I'm out going in the woods, hiking, hiking, camping with these. If I'm going to parks, I use these sticks as my tea. If, if you don't know what that is, I'm gonna show you what my tea is. Um, I decided where to put my my um, my hammock. See, these are collapsible, and they got a little spike on the tip. Okay. And this. When you're hiking with your backpack, this helps your, your, uh, your, uh, this part right here. So when you're hiking, you have less weight, plus you got two extra legs when you're walking with a 100 pound or 200 pound or 300 pound or whatever pound bag you have. This helps you out. Walking sticks. Now, this is my Molly too. Hey, yo, come over here. Woo! This is my Molly too. This baby has every C over here. All right. This baby has all the C's known to man. They got more than 11 in that bitch. Right here, more than 11. Now, if I'm going to my hobo camp or I'm packing uh, really going far, I need my precious, and this is my precious bag. Y'all seen that before. And I take this regardless if I'm going backpacking or park camping. Now there's two types of camping. They got park camping, which you bring your tent, just throw your tent out, or and hiking camping, which is this baby. Now I got some more junk over here. I'm gonna show you some of this other stuff. Look, I got the cookie can. Now, this is part of this part over here. That goes with my molly. Now over here, when I go camping, this is all my camera gear. Depends on what I'm doing. If I'm going to a park like this, I bring this. If I'm going like that, I would just bring that, that stand or this stick. This is a stabilizer, stabilize the uh, camera so it won't be so shaky. You ever see it, when you do this, it's like shaking like a sun gun. But when you get a softy stick, I don't call this a softy stick. I call it a, camera holder, whatever you want to call it, stabilizer, because I'll go take selfie pictures like some other people do. Now, when I go camping at a park, I usually take this bag. I just bought this at very cheap. It's a, a screen net that goes over the bench so me and my friend can be skeeter free. And, you know, we just bought this for that purpose. And over here, um, depends where I'm going. I carry the big Q beam. Uh, just so I can, just in case some coyotes are come out here and attack us 
at the park or raccoons, I got something for their ass. I got some raccoon and a light, but they don't leave. Now this bag is what I carry to the parks. See what's in it real quick. When I go to the parks, I carry a bundle of towels so I can take a bath, etc., etc. I got a lantern for the cavity. And I got an extra blanket for tonight because it's supposed to be cold as hell. And when I bring my tent, I have my little cot you see. In the same video, uh, Ranger Cookie meets Donnie. That's this cot here. No, Spring Break on Donnie's channel. That's where that cot, you see that cot at. And a bag of towels and a waterproof bag. I always have hygiene, bath stuff in my other bag. And usually with my towels, I have hygiene. Then I have a tent, a tin man tent, where I can stand in. Cause I'm getting too old to be kneeling down, crouching down. And I bring my precious, oh, my precious. And I got cookie can, two. I got one and two, it's a set. One's I have all the cleaning and the tarp, and the other one is uh, where you do your business. And it's kind of got stuff in it, spray stuff. You've seen the cookie can? Go to Ranger Cookie, the cookie can for the first annual bushcrafting meet, or whatever you want to call it. All right, here's some of my junk, and right now I'm ready to go through that molly because it's too heavy. Something's in there I don't use. I'm going to start taking stuff out. And the rest of my junk that I'm going to do some trading is in the car. That's over there. Alright, so let's begin. Let's find out what's in my molly. And I'm going to put my hammock right there. I decided to put my hammock right there because it's big enough for me. And if somebody else wants to put a hammock, it can go right there. And be, in the and be with the car lights. If the car lights come and shine, see? Right there where the car lights are going to be beaming into my tent <laughs> on my hammock. All right, um, let's see. I can change it up. I can move my tent, uh, my hammock right there instead of right there. Um, we'll see. Light, shine. I could also put another tarp, which is much thicker. It's not waterproof, but it'll block some of that light out if people keep coming in and out in the middle of the night. <laughs> All right, it's been seven minutes and 58 seconds. So, I'm gonna cut this one off and let you know about what's going on here. And we started for another part. All right, see you next video.